YouTubers, it's Mark from Truth Seeker, and I'm back in an old Viking picture. Um, I'll, as always, I'll leave you the links in the description. The first thing I'm going to ask you is to check the settings on your uh, YouTube browser that you're watching this in, that little round wheel at the bottom here. Uh, just go all the way down, you'll see, just go down and like right about here on the browser see where this is like right about here you see a wheel um, what I need you to do is to open that up and make sure you're watching it in 1080p I don't know how it's happening but it was brought to my attention by a viewer Purple Haze and uh, there you think you're watching 1080p and it gets knocked down to like 360 the lowest setting and all you're seeing is blur now I'm asking you please just make sure uh, just check it if it gets blurry when you're watching it check it because it's been brought to my attention by a lot of people and I'm not happy about it but what can I do right now alright let's get started look at this now why would you have to do this to I mean you could see what's back here there's all types of crazy piping and stuff that they blurred they put this white on top you can see the piping even comes back up to here. You see, in this they missed some of this. There's some type of machinery here. You see this? There's something going on here. There's a lot of symmetry. There's circles, all types. I mean, either that's from them blacking it out, and it's still hiding something, or this is really what's under there. I'm getting glimpses of it. See how this comes up? Let me see what's back here. Looks like, uh, I, I don't even know what to make of some of this. This looks like some type of antenna coming up. And then you see they throw this white over the top to give you that shadow effect. I mean, it's very easy in uh, Photoshop. It actually asks you, there's a setting of where you want the shadows to come from. And it automatically fills the shadows. You could pick from a top, 3 o'clock, 12 o'clock, whatever, you you know, 1 o'clock. You could pick wherever you want the shadows to come from. So, now look, here's all fake sand. All fake, see how they covered this up? But see this back here? See this? There's all types of carvings and symmetry. You don't even know if this is machinery or carvings. And to my new viewers, I just want to let you guys know, you know, I use a handheld for many reasons. The first one is just to get you this quality. I've tried a couple different of the, you know, video capture software, and something's happening in the compression for what I'm doing, and it's just not working out for me. So, I've tried a couple different programs. A buddy of mine gave me one, I bought two of them, and I'm just... I'm not happy with I'll use them for other things but you know look at this strange look at this stuff now of course the quality on this Viking photo is bad but you kind of get a sense of what they're doing here I'm gonna show you uh, let's see you see back up on this ridge how it looks like there's buildings see the structure see what all they do is just blur this you can't even say that that was a mountain at one time but you see how what they're blurring see they just put this white here see how I'm able to get structure out of it it just looks like this tall like three-story four-story buildings you got to go check this photo out. I'm going to give you the links. You see this? Like Mars Anomalies. He gets into these pictures and he inverts them. This would probably be a perfect one for uh, Chris over there to invert. Because, see this? There's all types. It's low quality, but there's something he does with inverting these pictures. It's just crazy. <laughs> You know, he's not adding anything, but he's just taking what's there and he's utilizing it, you know. Now, here's a perfect example of their trickery. See this blur? They put this white blur and it looks like a rock. But you see what's coming out of this? You see what's underneath it? 
this is all a statue. See, they put this black here on the side. See how I can get through some of it? Just beautiful, beautiful carvings. You see this, how it comes out? Let's see, let's see if I can get it for you. See how it almost looks like a seahorse coming out? I believe we're looking at grave markers. Very intricate stuff, but then other times it looks like there's machinery there too. I mean, I don't know if they use this machinery to dig, to make these, uh, you know, grave mar markers. See how they put the black? Let's see how close I can get. You see, this is the smudging that they're doing. See that blackout, and then you see what's underneath it. See how they blurred that. See, see what's under these smudges? Let's see how close we can get. Yes. They're so bad I can't even focus. But you see how they put this white blur? You'll see. You'll be look look for stuff that's black. Dark black and then with that white. See how there's a statue behind us? See what see the Let's see. You see how it's buried? First of all, in this fake sand. Alright, there's the eye. There's the other eye. See how this, it's like it's got a mustache, one of those curly mustaches, see the nose comes down? And you see how it curls? Let me see how close I can get you. You see? You see how that's a statue? just buried under this fake sand that's all this one I'm having a hard time getting anything out of but you can see there's another head back there see this almost looks like a gray alien that they blurred out the two eyes see the nose all they did was just put that white smudge and make it opaque they took this whole area and made it opaque see how this area comes in Looks like there's two people standing there that they blurred out. And you see these circles? See this? That almost looks like it's an entryway to the ground or something. But do you see what they blurred out? They just made them opaque. And it's funny that they're looking in the direction of the rover. It almost looks like a human standing next to a gray. See the two eyes? The head, the mouth. You see what I'm talking about? I think it's a statue, though. But, you know, I've had people say to me, "Oh, they're in, they're uh, you know people." I I don't know. I, I I happen to think some of them are statues, but I do think there's people up there. Then look at this. It looks like a cross. See how they just blurred this? This goes down. This is all fake sand. You could see another head there. But you could see the carvings in this. And I showed you that before, that big black smudge. You know, it's really hard to get anything out of this out of these older pictures because they didn't do it sparingly, you know. I don't know how any researcher looked at these pictures with a straight face. <laughs> I mean, really. If you showed me this picture, I would have laughed at you. If I was, you know, a researcher, a geologist or something, and you were NASA and you came to me and showed me these pictures and told me you wanted me to write a paper on it or something, I would have actually thrown it at, a, thrown it at somebody. I probably would have swung at somebody if you would have handed me this. Because I would have thought you were trying to make fun of me. That's how obvious it is to me. Now, hey, there's a lot of people out there that don't see this stuff. But what's funny is, it seems like 99% of my viewers are seeing what I'm seeing. It's kind of strange, huh, NASA? Who's the a-hole now? Some little guy from Jersey, huh? I mean, I knew this for a long time. I've been 
going through these pictures and watching guys on the internet and stuff and I just never wanted to be in the spotlight or have you know just you know have any attention really I'm just not that kind of person I'm just a very low key person I don't like uh you know, big parties, I don't like being around a million people, I don't need that in my life, you know, I got a couple of close people in my life and that's cool for me, you know, people you can trust, trust is a big thing, look at this, see how they put this hard, just hard black, but you see what they're covering, it's a statue, it's a beat and they put that white on top, that's all, it was very crude back then. To me, it's almost like they took a, a black magic marker with a ruler, just etched it out, you know, and filled it and then rescanned the photo. I mean, that's almost how crude it is. But like I said, if you would have handed me these pictures, I would have thrown them at you. See the stuff they're hiding? I mean, to me, it's as clear as day. I mean, I could look at any one of these pictures, and in a matter of a couple of seconds, I could pick everything out. Now, you see how this is all fake? This is all fake between these rocks. See back here? This is all fake. All of it. See what they're covering up? See how this comes down? See? This is all blurring. I know it's going to blur out on you, but I just want you to see what I'm showing you. This is a statue. There's the eye. Let's see if I get it to focus. It's so bad. I, I See where they added the white? There's the white that they added. And then there's the black. That's all. Let me see. This is a wall that they blurred out. See all the carvings in this, all that structure that's there. You see how this comes around? See how it circles around? You see? This actually looks like buildings back here. You see how it looks like buildings? See this? They blurred out. Just they went all the way. See this where the line is. This is where they added the blur. See that? You see what's sticking out of the top of it? It almost looks like a metal, and here it looks like a roof. See how this line separates? If you don't manipulate the picture like I am in Photoshop, see this? This is a wall of a building. You see the entryway? It's like a door. There's another door. It almost looks like it's got flags going around. You know how like you had a stadium? You have flags going around the outside. See what I'm talking about? How there's it comes around and it just goes around. Here's another statue coming out of it. See how they put this black line here? They're covering up a lot here. But this is a huge, huge. See that? They blurred all of this out here. See this? This almost looks like a bridge. See how it's coming up and over? See? What goes underneath it? Looks like there's actually something on it. This is fake. Don't even pay attention to that black thing. It's just hanging in the middle of air. Which is nonsense. See? It's just hanging in the middle of the air blocking another statue. This is all at it. All this uh, light colored stuff, it's all added. See what's back here? You see this coming up? Let me show you. There's like stacks coming up, you see them? You see what they blurred out? There's a bunch of stacks from buildings back there. This is what I mean, you gotta download the picture and look yourself, but there's buildings back here. See that structure? They put a little black smudge in front of it. 
You see this? See how it comes up? I know it's blurred, but I just want to. I'm going to show you now. You see how these are? They look like stacks coming up in the back. You know how we put like beacon lights on them and stuff. That's all. You see how this comes over? I take this to be water back here. See this? All back here. See where that line is? I take that to be water. And there's something coming across. But they blurred out. But you could see these buildings back here. You see them? It's just like Earth, guys. So, their technology may be a little different. You see this? There's another building that they blurred out. They just put that blur in front of it, that black. It was either a tank or something. You see this? This is like a coastline back here. Chris from uh, Mars, and if you're watching this, dude, you got to invert this. See this? How this is a building. See these buildings back here? You see this? And they put these black smudges in here. You see this statue? You see how the eyes got all weird stuff around it? You see that? I don't want to move. Ah, damn it. Let's see if I get it to focus for you guys one more time. There you go. See? See how that's a statue and then they put this blood nonsense around it? But you see how this looks like a huge building? See the flags going all the way around? You see what I mean? They just didn't happen to, to land in the middle of nowhere. They knew exactly where they were going. You see this? You see the light coming through? Some type of beautiful carving or structure. But there's all types of buildings in the back here. See this stuff? I'm gonna give you the links. See this? This is just a black smudge hanging in the air. It throws you off on the size, that's all. That's all that's doing. You gotta train your eyes not to pay attention to those black smudges. It's not easy. See, a lot of people are paying attention to those black smudges and taking them as rocks and it's just throwing them off on the size. Look at this thing. See how they blurred it? And this is all under fake sand. See this? This is all fake. All fake. All fake. Yeah. All, all that, that fake sand. See these carvings? Some of these are huge. See, I believe these things are carved with lasers. You see this? How they black blurred this out? See the black? How they came around? There's part of it coming out here. This could be a piece of machinery. You see what's coming out here? And then there's another piece here. You see all of this? This could be a definite piece of machinery. You see this thing coming out? Looks like a, a pipe or a barrel or something. I mean, you see the black smudge? It doesn't even match the shadow. But see how they went heavy on certain spots of it? Just get lost. Your eyes get lost. That's all that happens. NASA is a master at deception. They've become pretty good. Like this thing here is huge. This goes way back. I mean, there's all types of buildings and structure back there. You can see some of it. 
hacked that building. They blurred it. They blurred a lot of this. They were pretty good back then, even. But like I always say, the technology that they got is 10, 15 years ahead of us, maybe more. See how this looks like bricks, like there was something there. See this smudge, what it's covering up, see what's coming out of it. This is what NASA was so scared of people finding out. And I'll tell you guys, I'm a little pissed off because I'm calling news stations, Yahoo. I know what I see, I know what's here, and I know I'm not doing anything to manipulate it because I give you all the links. You can put it in your photo editor and get almost the same effect that I'm getting. Look at this, it almost looks like a ship that they just put this blur on. Like, I think this is water here. See this thing out here? I think that's some type of boat in the water. There's another boat. So they put this black smudge covering up something here. I this is to me this is water. That's a coastline. And to me that's water. This almost looks like a ship in a shipyard. See all this blur? They just add this fake sand here. See what they did? Here's another, you know, they just put these black smudges all over. You see this thing coming up? You see these? It almost looks like uh, glass tubes, or canisters or something. Oh no, that's the blur. They just see they, how they blurred and they made this translucent. Well, I take that to be a boat. You know, you know I'm not 100%, but there's blurring and that black stuff could really throw anybody off. Like this, see this blur? See what's coming out of the top. Yeah. But like always, I'm going to put the link out there. I want you to take a look at this picture. And you'll you'll see what I'm saying. It's just as plain as day. You know, when somebody points this stuff out to you, then it starts popping. But like I said, I've been looking at these pictures for a long time. And it just didn't come to me at first. So, you know, it takes a while. But, you know, when somebody starts, you know, like I got a friend of mine, and I show, start showing him stuff, he's, his eyesight's not that great, he's, you know, he's in his 40s, and when I start showing him things, he's like, oh yeah, you're right, look at that, you know. So sometimes it takes me to point some stuff out to people, other people just get it, and other people really get it, you know, they start texting me and you know sending me comments on stuff I missed which is great and I try to I try to read them all you know I got a lot of like this picture here I probably got about eight nine hours worth of work into it this is my fourth uh, no I'm sorry this is my third take I did two other ones and I just didn't like them so I'm gonna see how this one comes out maybe this is the one so but I put a lot of time you know See this? So, you know. You know, if I don't respond to you immediately or something, don't don't panic, you know. I got you. I appreciate it. I just need you to do do me a favor. Share it. Tell your friends about it. You know, email NASA if you can. Like it. All right, guys, this is Truth Seeker. Underneath the blur, I'm out.